Wow, wow, it's me, your host, Mr. WG, and you are watching the Spicy News. Dear subscribers, in today's video, I am going to tell you about why extremist religious group attacks Azerbaijani embassy in London and why authorities are silent yet. Dear subscribers, a radical religious group attacked and briefly occupied Azerbaijan's embassy in London, chanting slogans and replacing the Azerbaijani flag with one of their own. On August 4, several men stormed the embassy building, climbed up the balcony with a ladder, wrote slogans in Arabic on the wall, and hung religious posters. Eight people were arrested following the incident, London police reported. Dear subscribers, a group identified as the Mahdi Servants Union (MSU) took responsibility. The group spokesperson posting several celebratory videos and statements on his Twitter page. The day earlier, MSU had posted a statement on its website saying that the group's leader, Kuwait born Yasser Al Habib, had been informed about the persecution of a woman in Azerbaijan who had written shite slogans on the outside of her home and raised a shite flag. According to the statement, Azerbaijan's interior ministry said that the act amounted to extremism and that raising any flag other than the national flag was unacceptable. Dear subscribers, the episode was not reported in Azerbaijani media and there was no such statements on the interior ministry's website. The woman became a cause celebrity on social media of shite activists who called her Sayyade Shehla. Al Habib, the MSU statement continued, considered this incident as an indication of the extent of the degeneracy of the regime of the disgraced dictator Ilham Alviv, which is desperate to strip the religious and cultural identity of the Azari people and transform it into a western lifestyle mired in decadence, corruption and spiritual and moral poverty. Dear subscribers, the attack by London-based radicals is unacceptable and barbaric. Azerbaijan's ambassador to London wrote on Twitter, it directly undermined the principle of diplomatic premises inviolability. I am currently in Baku and grateful to see that our colleagues are safe in spite of the threat to their safety and security. Dear subscribers, it is for today. I will meet you in next video. Till then, kindly subscribe my channel and press the bell icon. Take care.